Hello and welcome. Yes, today we've got a wall connector install. What you're looking at here is a junction box. Those wires sticking out, the electrician pulled. It's a 40 amp circuit, 240 volts AC. The left conduit goes under this patio over to where the wall connector is going to be installed. This is where the wall connector is going to be installed. You can see we have a pedestal purchased from Tesla. The conduit comes up here. The bolts have been installed into the concrete when they put in the driveway. We will install the pedestal today, install a Tesla version three wall connector on it. That's the job today. The electricians pulled the wires to the junction box and he'll finish up the job once I get this installed. So let's go. This is where the pedestal mounts. I mounted a board with the bolts in it around the conduit. They poured the driveway. I removed the board and now I'll level up the pedestal and put an extension on this uh, and we will install the pedestal. The leveling bolts I had are stuck in the concrete so I added some stainless steel washers to not only level the pedestal forward to aft left to right and now we're straight up and down. I'll go ahead and uh, sweep this off and then I'll put some adhesive and some sealant underneath, keep the water and ice, and I'll put the pedestal on. Next stop, gotta take this uh, fish tape. It's a uh, spring steel band. You jam it in the conduit and it comes out the other end. It's used for pulling wire. That's what we're gonna do. Just like that, comes out the other side. Oh look, there's a snake coming out of the hole. That's where we hook the wire and we'll pull it right through. It's through! Yeah, got a little left over for the stub. A little on the other side, we're good. All right, now we gotta wait for our electrician to hook this up. Get the pedestal mounted here. Set it up to terminate the wall connector. Hey, look at that. Electrician did a great job. I'm assembling the wall connector here. And I just noticed that uh, if you don't have the um, connections tight uh, here, they'll get warm. And this is a sensor to tell. So there you go. Here's the junction box. Looks pretty good. Electrician did an awesome job. Gotta close it up now. And just like that, we have a wall connector. It's directly hooked to the Rivian. And it's happy. 10 kW. There you go. Wall connector is hooked up and working. Thanks for your help, Greg. It looks like the new wall connector is installed and working. I let it run overnight, charge the vehicle here without any issues. Charges at about 9.6 kilowatts, uh, not shown here with the decimal. But it's okay, it worked out just fine. So one project out of the way. If you like this video, give me a like, and if you would, please subscribe. Don't forget about the Tesla referral link 
It is excellent if you're buying a vehicle or buying any Tesla products, you'll get points to buy more stuff. Pass it along to folks you know that want to buy a new car because the referral link works for cars. Thanks for watching. I'll look for you in the next videos and take care.